Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're gonna go from Meta Bank all the way to Parramatta via Stillwater Bridge and Donald Wind Bridge. Uh, yeah, the, the weather's kinda, kinda gloomy today, but still feel like making this video today. So yeah, right now I'm on the Homebush Bay Corso and we're gonna head to the Donald Wind Bridge soon, which is that one. And yeah, see you guys there. So these are the stairs that can get onto the bridge, straight up there. But I don't normally take this one because there's so many steps. Yeah. So now we're on, headed onto the ramp to the Tom Wooden Bridge. So right now we're on the John Wooden Bridge, uh, just heading over to the Meadowbank Ferry Wharf now. Over there is Ride Bridge. I don't really go that way much, but I guess in the next video or some other time I'll, I'll give it a try. Yeah. So there's actually a few ways to get down there. Uh, that's the first way, shortest way. I usually take this one, but it's slippery when wet. The scenic way, I guess. <laughs> the road itself. That's if you really want to increase your Strava distance, you know what I mean? <laughs> but yeah. So we're finally across the bridge. Uh, I guess this is where the, 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 the pathway starts. Yeah. This looks like a nice path to work out at. Might give it a try sometime. Over there as well. These netball courts look interesting. Uh, maybe we could do intervals, I guess. Oh, let's try it. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, it's quite flat, it's nice. When it rains it's quite slippery though, there's a lot of, there's a lot of puddles, but yeah, it's not bad. I'm pretty sure it's grippy doing doing drive without weather, but yeah. Might give it a shot sometime. Do some laps around here. Alright, let's keep going. So there's a bit of a residential street here. Have a look. Yeah. It's pretty much the only part of the route that is residential, but it's quite short and wide, I guess. <laughs> you can run on the roads if you want, but just be careful, yeah? Yeah. So we're currently at Melrose Park, uh, just past Meadowbank now, or still part of it, I'm not really sure. But yeah, just gonna head to the car park now. Up there.
So now we're just passing by the George Kendall Riverside Park. Uh, have a look. Yeah. I think this is where they have the Parramatta Park run, or at least the area around where it starts. Never tried it myself, but I might give it a go sometime and, you know, do a video on it. Yeah. So I think we're in Ermington now. Uh, as soon as I see the white buildings, I sort of assume that's Ermington. Uh, yeah, we're gonna head to the bridge now, the Silver Water Bridge, and yeah. So down there is the Newington Armory and the Blacksland Riverside Park, and this whole pathway is the River Walk from the previous video. It goes all the way to Silver Water Bridge down there. And the whole route is around a bit over 2Ks, all the way to the Louise Sauvage Pathway, all the way down there. And sometimes I come here to do mile repeats, because it's over 2K, there's enough space for like 200 meter cooldown, and then repeat the interval and head back. And yeah, all right, let's head to the bridge now. So if you go up this bridge, you can get back to the river walk to the other side and there's two ways to get there the first way is through this entrance which we'll head, up, we'll head towards soon that goes up on the left side of the bridge and goes back through the car park and then back to the river walk uh, but I like to go the other way which is around the bridge or behind this bridge in front of us so yeah here's the first way we're going to head to the, the second way. So we're about to head onto the bridge now. Uh, it's probably the steepest part of this whole route, I guess. Yeah. I read somewhere that when it becomes healed, just smash it, just go sort of fast on it. So that when you need to go on heels on a race, I guess, or whatever, you're just so used to it that it's easy, I guess. So yeah, here we go. So yeah, just go across the bridge. Uh, I'll show you guys what's on the other side of it, but first, I've got to go back around. <laughs> so now we're just going to go through the car park and head on the other side of the bridge and continue our, our journey, I guess. Absolutely conquered that bridge, both sides. Now let's head on to Ride With Me. So I like the Ride With Me to Parramatta pathway, or cycleway I guess, because it's just flat, it's spacious, and it's quite nice, you know? So it's my favorite second half of this run, I guess. Although, Meta Bank's pretty nice too, yeah.
now we're heading out to a little crossing on the road. I like to call it the Ream Crossing. Yeah, yeah, because Ream. But yeah, just be careful here. Not much traffic, but yeah, look both sides before you cross. Yeah. So now we're just passing by the West of Sydney University Paramount South, South Campus. Uh, fun fact, I used to go here. Check it out. I think that's the library. And yeah, those are some old buildings. I used to explore this place when I used to go to uni. It's quite nice. Yeah, let's head on. So above us is the James Lewis Drive. Uh, I guess as we pass it, that's pretty much a matter. Yeah. Can't wait to see the bridge when it's done. Yeah, let's go. There's the Parramatta Ferry Wharf and here's a lovely set of stairs for all you Stairmaster Elite Pro Wizards out there who love to change stairs uh, uh, Yeah, check it out sometime oh, Alright, I'll give it a shot That was worth it. I'm exhausted now. But let's head on. So now we're at the final destination of our journey and that's Parramatta Park. Check it out. I like it because it's quite flat. It's very wide and spacious. But you gotta be careful because the, the footpaths and the cycle path, like it's shaved with the roads, I guess. So yeah, just be careful. And they also have like some festivals and events here sometimes. And yeah. So now we're heading past Wisteria Gardens. Check it out over there. Uh, it's a nice place. It's like, it's like a cottage, village, garden sort of thing, I guess. And it's quite nice for picnics or just to hike, I guess, or like walk around, go on a little date, that kind of stuff. Yeah, let's head on. So yeah, that's pretty much the way I like to run from Rhodes to Parramatta Park via the, the John Whitten Bridge, Meadowbank, Melrose Park, Irmington, Radomir, Parramatta and Parramatta Park. Yeah, I'm pretty tired now, just gonna call it a day here and I guess if you like the video, like the video, subscribe to the channel, all that kind of stuff. And if I miss any cool spots, let me know in the comments below and yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!